Hey guys, what's going on? It's OSS here with Gadget Hacks, and I'm going to be showing you how to add a third party keyboard that translate incoming and outgoing text for you into over 80 different languages. So the app is called Slated. It's, so once um, you've downloaded it, we're going to need to add it to our keyboard. So we're going to go to Settings, General, scroll down to Keyboard, go to Keyboards, Add New Keyboard. As you can see, I've already done that, and you're going to do that as well. Once you do that, we're also going to need to allow full access. It's one of those things with third-party keyboards. If you want them to work correctly, you're going to need to do that. Now, once we're out of that, um, I can just show you how the app works. So I have a text message that I've sent, and as you can see, this is in Spanish. Um, so if I want to translate that message, I can open this up and select the message, tap and hold, hit copy, and you'll see the translation here. Now, it's not 100% accurate because it uses Google Translate. So sometimes, as you can see, it's off. It depends on where your question marks are. It takes everything very literally. So make sure to, to double check. If you use simple phrases like, hello, thanks, how's it going, things like that, um, it should work correctly. Now, if I write myself a text message, you'll see the translation appear in this gray box. Simple message just to show you. And then I can hit send. So in order for me to switch out the languages I need to tap on this and then it'll switch the English to Spanish and I can hit send. If you want to switch languages just tap on this button right there and you can see that there are a bunch of different languages that you can choose from and the translation will again work just as you saw before and that's it so you hit X you hit, you type in your sentence and it should, appear, it should appear in the little prediction panel and then you get I just received a message so if I didn't know what that meant of course again I can hit copy and it'll translate not to German. You have to go back to Spanish, of course, because that was in Spanish. Go to Spanish, close out, try this again, and again. Not bad and your, it's because of the question mark. It's not bad and you. So, again, with any translation app that you're using on the internet or Google Translate or whatever, it's not going to be perfect, but you'll get the gist of what they are trying to say and it does a decent job of translating complicated sentences um, into whatever language you want. So again, check that out. It's called Slated. And make sure to let me know what you guys think in the comment section and also make sure to check out the full article on Gadget Hacks. Thanks for watching, guys.